Terra and the Sun by Emma Rountree For many years, the clan had faced hardship after hardship. The rivers had dried up, and the once plentiful herds had moved away. Worst of all, the air had become much colder. The people feared they would freeze to death, alone amidst a cold and ruined earth. Terra could bear to see her people suffer no longer, so she braved the dangers of the mountain. After many days of climbing, she reached the top and called forth the sun. Should my people die she told the sun angrily. You shall have no one to shine upon. No one will be left to care about you, and you'll fade away friendless and alone. The sun mulled this over and arrived at a decision. Very well, he answered. Here, take this small piece of me. Terror returned to the clan with the piece of the sun, and slowly the air warmed, the herds returned, and the rivers began to flow once again.